Oh boy, I'm back. It's all about the movie trailers. Um, so this time around YouTube, I am gonna be doing another reaction trailer uh, review slash reaction, whatever you wanna call it. Sorry. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna be doing this one on the brand new uh, Mission Impossible trailer because I saw it um, temporarily. But I didn't really watch it because I was like, this would be a great opportunity to be able to kind of do like a review with y'all. So the name of the movie is Mission Impossible Rogue Nation. And I don't know what it centers around, but I'm going to go ahead and do this uh, trailer reaction with y'all right now if I can find it. I think that's it. So this is what happens. I look at the movie trailers page and it messes me up. Um, I got one more trailer reaction um, today and it's going to be for San Andreas so take a look for that very soon um, and in addition to that oh my gosh y'all already know I, as a DC fan like to, it's exactly 365 days until Batman vs Superman so Zack Snyder decided to release something epic out to everybody so I'm going to talk about that really soon but anyway Here's the trailer. Choose your next words very carefully. Where is Hunt? Ooh. Dang. We've never met before, right? Fire Ooh, classic Mission Impossible 2, baby. Ready or not. Here I come. What the heck? What's up, baby? Look, Rogue Nation. Oh shoot. Man, how does this man move like this as old as he is? Oh, that's sick. <laughs> I saw Bing Reigns. I saw Jeremy Renner. Bro, what in the world? What? What? Hi. The freaking, um... Yo, Tom is crazy, man. He always... I say this. He is a showman, man. Like, he knows how to raise the bar every single time. Like, he doesn't disappoint. Like, for him to be clinging on to the edge of a plane, and it looks like he really is, I think that probably a lot of that is CG, but I... I, I don't... I wouldn't put it past him to have some kind of, like, um... I don't know, maybe they added some kind of practical way of him being able to do that without falling. I'm not sure, but the scene looks real just from the takeoff. And so that, that is set the bar from how the stunts are going to be. I think the Ghost Protocol is a pretty decent movie. That's the only one I don't own from the franchise. Um, I've been waiting because I think the other ones I have are on DVD. I don't have any of them on Blu-ray, I don't think. Um, so I'm going to wait probably until this one comes out on Blu-ray to probably get all of them together because I'm pretty sure I, I can't imagine them doing a sixth one. But then again, I said the same thing about the like Fast and Furious franchise. And to me, looking at this trailer, like I almost immediately compare it to the Fast and Furious franchise because now the Fran Fast and Furious franchise is not just about the cars. It's about the action, like just flat out. So it's like, I don't know if this action can top that action. And if it doesn't, then it has to be a better controlled central story. Like I think Ghost Protocol fell under the rappers because it wasn't as serious as like the third one um, when he got his wife threatened and all that kind of stuff. <clears throat> but I think in this one, like bring everybody back. Bing Rames, Jeremy Renner, new girl that looks like she actually Either one is equal to uh, Tom Cruise's character. Uh, I'm not sure, but Ethan Hunt is back, and I mean, I can't believe how this guy can move, man. Like Tom Cruise, he is an artist of his craft. He makes his body do certain things that I just, I, I mean, as a stunt person, like I would be looking at him like, look, he's got it, <laughs> because I mean, he's just been doing it for years. Like he. He's trained himself to do certain things and just he knows how to catch himself on film. And I mean, Edge of Tomorrow was legit. Like, anybody that hasn't seen that, that was a really great movie. I didn't see Oblivion as much as Edge of Tomorrow, but Edge of Tomorrow was the last one I got and I bought it on Blu ray for sure. I should have got it on Blu ray 3D. I messed up on that. 
Um, but yeah, I think this is gonna be a win. I think this is, might be better than Ghost Protocol, but I don't think it'll ever top the first one and the second one in my mind. I just, I just don't think they're gonna do that. Like, I think that what sets Mission Impossible series apart from Fast and Furious is that there were years that in between the second Fast and Furious, Tokyo Drift, and then the newer franchise. And like how that evolved into something amazing is the fact that Tokyo Drift takes place before um, the new movie that's about to come out. And, and like it, it's the centerpiece for everything. And it took place after everything and all the events that happened. And so they redid the whole entire franchise over, technically, based off of a awesome plot point. And I, I don't feel like this franchise has enough headway to make something epic happen and pull it a whole different way like that. But I, it doesn't say, it's not to say that this isn't going to be a good movie. I think that Mission Impossible Rogue Nation is going to be pretty entertaining. And I think that the action is not going to disappoint at all. I mean, they've got classic nods to like the glasses, like the motorcycle. I mean, just him on the top of like uh, the plane like that. It brought me back to the second one when he was on the cliff, and I, I remember when they were interviewing him about like him doing rock climbing for the first time, and him actually doing the stunt, and uh, how dangerous it was. I mean, I was like, okay, he's setting the bar. So this one should be pretty good too. So definitely uh, check out the trailer in the description bar below if you like this reaction trailer review. Please let me know with a like, and thanks for everybody for subscribing. It's been really awesome. I'm gonna ha do one more movie trailer reaction. I'm gonna take this freaking shirt off because I'm hot and I'm hungry. And then after I do the reaction to uh, the next one, which is San Andreas, I'm gonna be talking about something awesome that's come to DC. So I'll look for that also tonight and hopefully maybe I can get to Arrow and trying to catch up the last few episodes so I can catch up tonight. Anyway, SEL0320 signing out. Check out this Mission Impossible. Rogue Nation trailer, baby. Peace, everybody.